What's up, everyone? It's Turner Fan 77 and I'm here with my daughter, Malia. Hello. And we're mm. about to go see Thor Love and Thunder. I'm excited to see this uh, Taika Waititi. I can't say his name right, so I apologize. He's becoming one of my favorite directors, so I'm excited what he's going to do with this installment because he kicked ass on Thor Ragnarok. Um, yeah, I'm just stoked to see this. What about you? I'm really excited to see this movie. I mean, I like Thor. I like Bakuli. I like all of the Guardians of the Galaxy. I think it's going to be a good movie. So, yeah, I'm excited to see it. Yeah, we'll be right back with our Out of Theater thought. So, we just got back uh, from seeing Thor Love and Thunder. Um, first, I, before I give my um, thoughts, I want to get... Um, Malia's thoughts. So, Malia, what'd you think? Okay, so I love. Marvel. Hey, remember, wait, no spoilers, okay? Just... Yeah, okay, I love Marvel movies, but this one is, it didn't stick with me. I'm Jane was in the trailer. I know that, so I can say that, right? Yeah, she's okay. in the trailer, yeah. <laughs> um, she, she stood out to me. I thought that she, she was, she's cool, but this wasn't a Marvel movie that I think I would rewatch, like, every, like, a binge watch, you know what I mean? Like, I don't think that movie was the best out of all of them. I definitely. Can I say Thor Ragnarok is better? <laughs> yeah, you can say Thor. We can say whatever okay. the hell you want. Okay, yeah. I thought Thor Ragnarok was kind of better than this one. Look, I don't think this was the best Marvel movies they've made. I thought like they could do better. But I thought the acting was good. Okay. Okay. So, we saw two movies this week in the theater. Yeah. Uh, we saw <laughs> Minions. <laughs> and we saw uh, Thor. Love and Thunder. Yeah. Which one was better? Okay. So, I don't really know. To be honest. Minions is funnier. But Thor Love and Thunder, I like Marvel better, so like it goes both ways, so I don't know. You don't know? She don't know what the hell talking about. <laughs> okay, so out of the two Thor or the two Marvel movies we saw um this year so far, mm -hmm. between Doctor Strange and Thor, which one was better? Doctor Strange, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> See this is what we're gonna do. Also, I don't really like Thor that much, but also I feel like it was, that movie's good though. It was alright. Uh, I don't know. It wasn't the best. <laughs> she don't know what the hell she's Dr. talking Strange about. Doctor Strange is better, though. Doctor Strange is better? Yeah. Uh, I disagree. I but, okay, so... So, you're, would you see it again in the theaters? No. Would you wait till I get it on 4K? I'd probably watch it, like, once. My sister didn't like it either. She thought it was... Yeah, her sister fun. didn't like it either. So, okay. So, let's get to my thoughts here. <laughs> okay. Um, was this better than Thor Ragnarok? No. Not by any stretch of imagination. Thor Ragnarok was amazing. I think Thor Ragnarok was an A-plus film because it revitalized uh, the Thor character. This movie did not. Um, Why I love what Taika Waititi, again, I can't say his name right. He's a great director. Um, I think they le leaned too heavy in the jokes. Um, some of them did not land. Uh, some of them kind of felt forced. But it did not take away from the film for me. Um, I kind of just ignored it. But when you got to the heart of the movie with Gore, Christian Bell was fantastic. Um, Natalie Portman was amazing. Her uh, portrayal as Mighty Thor, she oh, she's awesome. Uh, Valkyrie, um, Tessa Thompson, I think that's her name. Oh, she was, I, I want to see more of her. I really dig her character. Russell Crowe was pretty cool. Um... And Chris Hemsworth, again, as Thor, um, man, he just owns that role. He looks like he's having fun. Um, can't wait to see what he does next. Um, what would I give this film? I think I would give uh, Thor, Love and Thunder a B-. minus. Um, yeah, I'll say a B-. minus. Um, will I rush to see it in the theaters? No. Um... But I will, <laughs> but I will buy it on um, 4K when it comes out to watch it again. So there you have it. This is our thoughts on um, Thor: Love and Thunder. Thanks for watching. Uh, remember, hit the like, um, subscribe, and turn your notifications on. And hey, when you guys finally see Thor: Love and Thunder, um, type in the comments and tell us what we thought of it because uh, we love to interact and know what you guys think. Thanks for watching. Remember, be kind.